Invisible children supporters are covering the night. Students from American University and other schools joined Invisible Children organizers at Diamond Teague Park to gather materials to poster all over the nation's capital. Rafe Dessa, street team organizer for DC, says that they began organizing weeks before to cover the night. We've kind of been networking with the different clubs like at American University, George Mason, Georgetown, finding the network of supporters and building a, a community around the idea of of social justice. I'm standing right outside National Stadium where Invisible Children supporters are here to cover the night. Travis Roberts, a junior at AU, says they want to send a message to Congress. We want to make sure as congressmen come back from recess and as the congressional aides are coming back to work that they see that this movement has not really given up since Coney 2012. We want to make sure they can see the posters and that they see, you know, kind of a reminder that it's time for them to take action. Jacob Achaye, a former child soldier and invisible children advocate, says that the criticism that the organization has gotten is from a misunderstanding of the message they are trying to send. Like in the criticism that came up, I think uh, we had these people who were saying, we say that the film actually say that there's war in Northern Uganda. I was like saying, you guys have to go and watch because the movie is talking about stopping the war, no matter where it is. And that is what we are up for. Ben Kesey, CEO and executive director of Invisible Children says that the criticism also comes with a wave of support and that the current effort is the best way to achieve their goal of stopping the LRA. There's been, there's been a lot of people with questions. There's also been a lot of people that have been so supportive. You know, the, the mission to stop the LRA is non-controversial. You know, that's something that everyone can agree on. Uh, however, the tactics used to get there, it's tricky. And, you know, we've... We believe that supporting the ongoing regional effort um, that's led by the local leaders on the ground is the best way to do that. Now, there's other people that have difference of opinions. Supporters postered into the early hours of the morning and posted pictures using social networks like Twitter. Reporting for ATV News, I'm Maureen Chaudhary.